Hey friends and welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, my name is Lindsay Bowden and I help teachers create engaging and professional resources for their classroom or to sell online. So today I'm gonna to be talking about a really cool website called graphfree.com. But before I get into this, go ahead and subscribe to my channel so you don't miss any videos and hit the bell icon so you can be notified anytime I upload a new video. Okay, so graphfree.com is obviously a free website where you can create graphs for your resources. This was actually created by a former math teacher. He invented this website and created the code and all of that is way above my head, but it's really cool. Um, if you don't know anything about me, I create all my own math resources using PowerPoint and Excel, and I graph in Excel, which I have some other videos that I'll link below about that. But this is also a great option. So I'm going to kind of give you a quick tutorial and talk a little bit about the things that you can do with graphfree.com. So when you go to the homepage, this is what you will see, and you click Start Graphing Now. And you're going to click on plot one to actually start graphing. Now he does have lots of helpful tips to, you know, kind of make those more complicated graphs. So you can read through there. You can make bigger or smaller graphs so that they'll be a little more clear. I'm just gonna stick with 300 by 300. And then when you actually want to start graphing, you go to plot one. So let's just say I want to graph the line X plus two, and then I'm going to hit enter. And as you can see right up here, it is graphed. So how do you get this graph to a resource? Well, you just right click on it, save image. I'm just going to call this graph one. I always put things on my desktop so I can quickly find it. Save. And now you see it's right here. You can insert it into a resource and it's ready to go. So there are lots of different options that you can do. You can change the color, the type of line. You can choose to have arrows or no arrows. You can add asymptotes. You can even graph systems by using plot number two. You can gra graph up to six different functions on the same graph plot. So let's say I wanted to graph a parabola, so x squared, and they, he does give you some tips about how to type different things, but of course, if you want to type an exponent, you would use the caret key, which is shift six. And it's just a really cool, quick way to graph. Now I will say, I did find a couple of little weird things that happen. For example, when I graph 0.5x plus three, you get this extra little arrow up here. Just a few little glitches, but nothing too crazy. It's a really great way to quickly graph for resources. And there are other options here, like if you wanna do piecewise, XY scatter, you can just type the order pairs. You can even do inequality. So let's say that I want to graph a linear inequality. So I'm gonna graph the line X plus five. Oops, let me go back to function here, <laughs> X plus five. And then if I want to shade, I can come down here to shading. And you just choose a point within the region that you want to shade. So let's say I want to shade below the line. I'm just going to choose zero, zero, enter. And you can change the color of the shading here. And then again, if you want to save it, just right click, save image as graph two. It's right there on your desktop ready to go. Now I have had students from my Math Resource Academy reach out to him and ask if they could use his graphs for commercial use and he did tell them yes I didn't personally hear that from him but they said that he was fine with that so you could use these to sell online but again you may want to reach out to him he has contact information right down here you can even send him a cup of coffee to say thank you for this amazing amazing program that he created so awesome so thank you so much i hope this was helpful if you want to know more about making amazing engaging math resources that your students will love check out my website lindsaybowden.com for more tips thanks and i'll see you in the next video